Angelina Jolie is known for a radiant image of allure and beauty. She has been hailed as the world's most beautiful woman by major publications such as Vogue, People, and Vanity Fair. She's also been acclaimed as the most attractive woman alive by media outlets like Esquire, FHM, and Empire. These accolades often stem from public polls, with Jolie surpassing other celebrities. Her most prominent features include numerous tattoos, captivating eyes, and notably full lips, described akin to Kirk Douglas's chin or Betty Davis's eyes. Among her estimated 20 tattoos are proverbial phrases like, what nourishes me also destroys me, in Latin, prayers, and even geographical coordinate tattoos symbolizing her first meetings with her adopted children. While Jolie's glamorous image has contributed to her success in films like Lara Croft, Tomb Raider and Beowulf, it has also posed limitations. Some observations suggest that her sexual allure has constrained the ability to portray diverse roles. Even possessing the most beautiful face on the planet could potentially compromise her credibility in acting, as stated by director Clint Eastwood while directing Jolie in the film Changeling. Angelina Jolie's presence has had a profound impact on mainstream culture. In 2002, Sarah Warren, the founder of After Ellen, noted something remarkable. Many sexually diverse women spoke openly about their attraction to Jolie. This was considered a new step in American culture, as she mentioned, because Hollywood has many beautiful women, but few with Jolie's style, showing an overwhelming interest in gender and sexual orientation that she represents. Jolie's distinctive appearance became a standard of beauty that many Western women sought to emulate through cosmetic surgery. In 2007, she was seen as the gold standard of beauty, especially regarding her full lips, a feature that many tried to imitate in the years following. A survey by Allure magazine in 2011 indicated that Jolie represented the American ideal of beauty, surpassing even the model Christy Brinkley in 1991. According to writer Elizabeth Angel, society had moved beyond the Barbie doll ideal and embraced something entirely different. In 2013, Jeffrey Kluger from Time also agreed that for many years, Jolie had become an icon of feminine ideal. Her discussions on undergoing a preventive double mastectomy changed the perception of her beauty, marking a redefinition of societal beauty standards. Jolie is an icon of style and a trailblazer in setting fashion trends for celebrities. She began gracing red carpets at the age of 10, establishing a long-term relationship with Versace from the early 1990s. In the early stages of her acting career, her fashion style stood out with gothic attire, leather, and a coquette look, described as dark, vampy, dramatic, and alluring. One of her notable early fashion moments was wearing a sequin gown by Randolph Duke at the 1999 Golden Globe Awards. Her appearance in a white satin gown by Mark Bauer at the 76th Academy Awards received high praise, drawing comparisons to classic Hollywood starlet fashion. Transitioning into directing and humanitarian work, Jolie's style became more refined, understated, and glamorous, often associated with old Hollywood glamour. Throughout the 2010s, she often sported satin gowns, diamond jewelry, and Grecian-inspired attire. One of her most significant fashion appearances was at the 84th Academy Awards in a black Versace gown, considered one of the most iconic outfits in fashion and mainstream culture history, even inspiring internet memes about her posing. Jolie prefers investing in quality pieces, and from the 2020s, she began adopting more sustainable fashion, focusing on items that positively impact the environment. Angelina Jolie's confirmation of her foray into the fashion industry with an upcoming personal brand has certainly grabbed the attention of her fans. Angelina Jolie's confirmation of her foray into the fashion industry with an upcoming personal brand has certainly grabbed the attention of her fans. Hollywood actress Angelina Jolie thrilled fans when she revealed that her own fashion brand launched in October this year. The famous actress chose the name Atelier Jolie for her fashion brand, a child, that she has nurtured for a long time. I have especially loved tailoring since I was a child. She is my inspiration, always taking advantage of old clothes to create new, very fashionable outfits. That is the goal that my brand follows. Pursuit, using surplus materials to design special, personal style clothes, Angelina Jolie declared. Angelina Jolie also added that the idea of establishing her own fashion brand received enthusiastic support from her six children. The kids were very excited about their mom's idea and offered many interesting suggestions for Angelina Jolie's upcoming collection. From a young age, Angelina Jolie's six children have been encouraged by their mother to express their individuality through clothing. Therefore, whenever they appear in public or at events, the Hollywood family always attracts special attention and interest from the media regarding both the mother and children's fashion styles. Angelina Jolie also consistently teaches her children about thriftiness, advising against extravagance or wasteful spending on luxury items. She encourages the kids to reuse and share clothes among themselves to avoid unnecessary waste. 
Angelina Jolie isn't just a leading Hollywood actress and film producer, she's also a responsible mother to six children. Beyond dedicating time to her career, she's a woman with a strong social conscience, actively involved in activities advocating for children's rights worldwide. Despite her celebrity status, Jolie acknowledges that the nature of her work demands owning and using expensive clothing and accessories. However, she consistently knows how to blend old and new garments to create her individual style, even using them until they're worn out. This showcases her thriftiness and awareness of maximizing resources. In her roles as a mother and influential artist, Jolie has shown a strong commitment to social and humanitarian issues, particularly in advocating for children's rights. Angelina Jolie has received widespread recognition for her humanitarian work, honored with numerous prestigious awards from international organizations. From the Humanitarian Award by the Church World Service's Immigration and Refugee Program in August 2002 to being the first recipient of the UN Correspondence Association Global Citizen of the Year Award in October 2003, Jolie has consistently been honored for her significant contributions in the humanitarian field. UNA USA presented her with the Global Humanitarian Award in October 2005, and later in November 2007, she received the Freedom Award from the International Rescue Committee. The recognition continued as the UN High Commissioner for Refugees Antonio Guterres awarded her a gold pin, specifically reserved for long-serving staff, in acknowledgement of Jolie's dedication as a UNHCR Goodwill Ambassador in October 2011. In 2013, Jolie was awarded the Jean Hersholt Humanitarian Award, an honorary Oscar from the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences Board of Governors. In 2014, she was appointed an honorary Dame Commander of the Order of St. Michael and St. George for her foreign policy contributions to the United Kingdom and efforts to end sexual violence in conflict zones. The prestigious recognition continued when Queen Elizabeth II bestowed upon Jolie the title of Honorary Dame Grand Cross of the Most Distinguished Order of St. Michael and St. George in a private ceremony in October the following year. Angelina Jolie is not only an outstanding actress but also a renowned humanitarian activist. Since September 2007, she has chaired the Education Partnership for Children in Conflict, an initiative providing policies and funding for educational programs in conflict-affected areas. This partnership has supported educational projects for refugee children in Iraq, youth affected by the Darfur conflict, and girls in rural areas of Afghanistan, among many other groups. With a dedication to educating children, Jolie has funded numerous schools and boarding facilities for girls in refugee camps and settlements in Kenya and Afghanistan. In addition to infrastructure support, she has established and supported a range of health and education centers, particularly for children affected by HIV in Cambodia and Ethiopia. Moreover, Jolie is an executive producer for the BBC's My World program, an initiative aiming to help adolescents discern high-quality journalism from low-quality media. She also collaborated with the International Rescue Committee to publish the book, Know Your Rights, with the goal of enhancing understanding of children's rights.